Hello? Hello? Yeah, look at, and I got a big head. I got a big head. Look at how the size of my big old head. I am finally trying Ted's Market. Living in San Francisco my entire life, I've never been. Can I get the, uh, what is it? A Club Ted on a sourdough? Yeah. And is it possible to add uh, jalapenos? Mm -hmm. Yeah. How much is it? Provolone? Provolone? Yeah. So everything with jalapenos. Yeah. I know, it's tough. I bet. Yeah, that was my second choice. The pastrami, yeah. Really? Dang. I should just... Mm. No, you know what? Let me just get the club and then I'll get the pastrami um, also. Just to try it, because I never tried it. Okay, I secured the bag. We got a pastrami and a club sandwich. I'm ready. I'm excited. You know, I love me a good club. And I asked them what is their best seller and it is their pastrami, so... That was my second choice anyway. So I got best of both worlds. Let's go eat it. I am back at the crib, as you see. <sighs> Take these off. Oh, we got, we got the goods, y'all. Ted's Club. Look at that. Hello? Oh, is the president calling? Yeah, I'm gonna need my student debt paid off. Thank you. So we got that. And we got the New York pastrami, Ted's Club, New York pastrami. Hello, Keith Lee, you trying to collab? Come to San Francisco for a redo, okay? And we got the New York pastrami. Again, measurement based on my big old head. Does it size up? Yes, it does. <laughs> so which one should I start off with first? I think I'm gonna go, so I always order a club anywhere I go, anything turkey sandwich related. Usually I'll add roast beef. Lately, I've been into pastrami and I asked them, what is your favorite sandwich or what is your most popular uh, sandwich on the menu? And they said the New York pastrami. So I'm gonna start with the pastrami. Let's do it. some more lighting we need some there we go there we go wow look at that packed in there let's go i got it on sourdough bread i got it let's try it and rate it one through ten just kidding no ratings but this will determine if i go back also i got my teeth done last year year and a half ago and my taste test is usually when I bite into the sandwich, do I still have teeth at the end of it? <laughs> so just full transparency, I normally don't eat pickles in my sandwiches, but I'm gonna try it just for the sake of everything. And it's pastrami, lettuce, tomatoes, pickles, red onion, Swiss cheese, mayo mustard. I think it's mustard. I don't know if it's brown mustard, but here we go. Mm-hmm. Oh my god. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And that's just after one bite. The sourdough is so soft, but the top is crunchy, but not in a way that's gonna like break your teeth. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Wow. And I actually enjoyed the pickles in here. Wow, that's good. Okay, let's bite it from this side. Wow. Mm. Damn, that's a good sandwich. I get why they've been open for over 50 years.
not as good with the pickle. Damn. That, that's real good. Damn, I was gonna try and save this other half. I don't think I could. <laughs> I got the little drippery. Man, this is hella good. Mm-hmm. Wow. Wow. I did not spit anything out. <laughs> this is my live reaction. This doesn't even need the chips. This doesn't, I'm, I wouldn't take anything out. I wouldn't add it, I wouldn't change anything. This was probably the best pastrami sandwich I've had ever. I get, the, I get it now. I wouldn't even call it hype because there's not much hype. It's just one of those local spots that people go to. And unfortunately, living here my entire life, I've never been until today. And that's okay. No time to dwell. No time to complain or be sad because I made it. Wow. Damn, that's a good sandwich. Okay, let's move on to Ted's Club. Again, look at how big old sandwich from the side in the front. She got a donk. Damn. Sheesh, look at that. I added jalapenos to mine on sourdough, mayonnaise, mustard, everything. I even got the pickle, tomato, bacon, lettuce, turkey. Look at that, look at that, wow. So it looks like that is real. That turkey is thick. Look at that. Do you get jalapenos in your sandwich? Let me know. My bestie put me on that and she reminded me how amazing jalapenos are in pretty much everything, but particularly in a good deli sandwich. So here we go. This is the Ted's Club on sourdough. Oh, mm. yeah, everything on it. Okay, we're spilling everywhere. Let's go. Do you squeeze your sandwich before you eat them? Oh my god. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Damn. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Man. If you don't know, now you know. Ted's Market. A strami and a turkey. Here, have some, have some. Have some turkey. Pastrami. Turkey pastrami. Turkey pastrami. Turkey pastrami. Dude, these sandwiches, I don't know if I could share. I have to share, I'm gonna be nice. But, wow. I'm going back for another bite of the club. Mm-hmm. Jalapeno. Mm -hmm. Fire. I am making a mess here in my office. <laughs> but this is so good. Oh, I got turkey. Okay, so sourdough, turkey club with jalapenos and provolone, tomatoes, jalapenos, mayonnaise, mustard, pickles. Damn, this is like on a most basic level of a sandwich and this is so good again she said that her favorite right now because she's been working there for so long is tuna and i love tuna so next time i go i'm gonna definitely try the tuna so if anyone wants to come with me next time to ted's market we'll split a sandwich we'll, we'll get different flavors or different flavors different kinds because this is i don't think i'll go anywhere else for my sandwiches moving forward I don't think I'll go anywhere else for my sandwiches moving forward. It's that serious. And you know, the city has hella good places, hella good delis, 
Hella good cutty spots where you could get a good sandwich. No love lost to any of them. But this right here, I didn't even, they ran out of Dutch Crunch. They were sold out. They said you got to go early for the Dutch Crunch. So I still got a lot to try there. But Ted's Market, definitely recommend it. Everyone was super nice. They were very quick, efficient, and there was only two people working behind the counter. It's a Saturday afternoon. Give it a try. Fire out. I want to keep this sandwich series going, so where should I go next? And let me know in the comments if you will be checking out Ted's Market slash Deli. Hopefully you can try the Dutch Crunch because I'm going to go back and try it for myself. Let's go. Now keep watching. There's more. Nothing like a good sandwich to just make your day. If you are having a bad day, even if you're having a great, amazing day, which I am, Go treat yourself to some place you enjoy eating. Man, I know I have a whole other half, but I'm still working on these other two right here. And it's truly like a race to the finish line for me. So I don't know when you're eating something you really enjoy, do you... And it's like, say it's two different things, but you enjoy and love the flavors of each. When you're getting to the end of the meal, do you choose what's gonna be your last bite? Or do you just eat it mindlessly, not even thinking about it, and you just overall enjoy it? I'm curious, because right now I'm sitting here debating if I want my last bite of this meal, for now, to be pastrami or turkey club. This is hard-hitting questions I'm hitting you guys with in 2024. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> but I'm leaning towards pastrami because something about the way she toasted it is just perfection. The bread is so soft and moist. I should have asked if they make their bread in-house. I forgot to ask that one question, but the sourdough against the pastrami. And again, I'm so shocked that I enjoyed the pickles. Gosh, they're so they're both really good, but I think the pastrami is gonna be the last bite for this half, these halves of the sandwich. So let me know. We got two sandwiches, chips. Let's do this. <laughs> 